What's going on everybody? We are here at Wood Island today. <laughs> we got mullet. We got mullet today. I've had a lot of success on this stuff in the past. The tide is high right now, so we're gonna have an outgoing tide. We're here early in the morning. It's gonna be freaking hot today. Let's get set up. Let's get this experiment started. You guys know how these catfish pull, man. You can't be putting in your rod holders like a weenie. Go fish cam. That's the regular rig that we always use there, guys. Kind of curious to see this one. This will be the first bait that's an actual fish tested. Go fish cam. All right, first cast of the day. Woohoo, we kind of sent that one. All right guys, let's get right into it here. Kind of liking these commentary type videos. You guys seem to be liking them as well. So we're gonna keep rolling with it. I noticed a lot more carp this day. So you guys are gonna see a lot of carp in here. That's for sure. Also to note, the water was a little bit murky. Um, it seemed to get a little better as the day went on. So bear with me on that. So many carp. All right, here our first bite is a little hesitant, just kind of grabs a little piece of it right there and does not seem to like it. Here we're gonna have a carp wanting some air time. He actually hangs in front of the camera for quite a while. We'll see over here to the right, that catfish just comes in, scoops it up. Not like a fish is gonna go. Goodness. He ain't big, he just thinks he is. Finally got a committer. Jeez. That rod was bent right there just for this little guy too. Look at that. All that for that little fish, man. <laughs> Pretty much the same size fish we catch out here. There he is, guys. First fish of the day. Hopefully it doesn't take too long to get our second one. Toss him back there. He went the wrong way. <laughs> there you go. We'll get some fresh bait on here and do that again. Definitely seeing a lot of bait fish, pretty standard as we uh, found out. Here, something moves out of frame. I'm not too sure what it could have been. Probably a bait fish. Look at the hesitation. Oh, so much hesitation. Oh. Thinking that bait's not on there anymore. Have to find out though. 
Yeah, it's definitely pecked off. All right, well, we'll get this one back in the water. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Back in the hot zone. This was one of the most solid bites I had gotten this whole time. Looking at this footage back. Do it, baby. I believe he just had it and was swimming with it as well. better one there the leader broke I'll be furious nope dang all that finicking we finally get a good takedown and we lose them hope these fish can make up their mind this time let's do it all right guys so uh, so far looks like the fish are being pretty finicky towards the mullet um, they seem to be taking it down, taking pecks at it, taking swipes at it. And then uh, that one takedown, real, real hard takedown. We picked up the rod and he was gone. So uh, I don't know what's going on down there. Hopefully the footage is telling the story for me. But on top of the water, it looks like they are pretty shy to it so far. I think here the bait was stuck on the camera. So when we got bit, you weren't able to see the fish come up to it there, but it was a pretty decent bite. We got him. Finally, man. Took a bit. All right, let's see what we got here. Doesn't feel too big. Whew, he's little. Ah, oh, our line was tangled too. That sucks. It's the only problem with uh, using this. Because the one that we lost was significantly bigger, but hey, number two landed of the day. There he goes. All righty. Another piece of mullet. Maybe they're warming up to it now. <clears throat> or maybe I just jinxed myself. One of the two. Uh, let's launch this one a little further if we can. Maybe. something here moving off camera yet again kicks up a lot of sand there here a, another carp wants some air time he kind of just sits in front of the camera for a little bit pretty good size Here you see a catfish just come at the camera head on like that. Uh, 
There goes something else. Couldn't tell if that was a catfish. Oh, yeah, definitely a catfish. Whiskers right there. Seems a bit the smell attracted them, but they just weren't quite sold on it. If you guys are enjoying the video, please leave a like down below. These take a little bit longer to edit than the usual videos, uh, so any extra support is definitely appreciated. Here, this catfish, there's not much hesitation at all. Comes in, scoops it up. Right as I was about to change the battery. Literally have it in my hand. Let's see what we got here. Another blue. I hope we're getting some good footage with this thing down there, man. But there he is, nothing big really at all but hey we get to learn about them we get to see how they react to different baits down there from their perspective so can't really complain about the size Here, right away, we got some fish pecking at the bait before the dust even settles down there. There, we see this guy cruising. Takes a few bites and sucks it in. Another one down there in the corner pecking at it. Is not quite sold. And another one pecking at it, not sold on it. Interesting results here. I figured they were gonna be tearing it up. As he comes in and grabs it, this one got it pretty solid. I think he's swimming with it. That was weird. Was swimming with it, at least it looked like it. It's a nothing. Weird bite today. I'm curious to see how they're acting down there. Seems very weird. On to the go fish cam. There she goes. Sucks it in here. Boom. He actually snapped my leader there. Um, after I broke this one off, I started tying 25 pound uh, instead of 20 pound. If you guys don't know, I tie them a little bit smaller just to make sure if anything breaks, it's the leader and oh not my main line God. to the camera. So we upped it to 25 leader. pound. That's been doing good so far. Yep. <sighs> All right, guys, unless I can get another drop, that is going to be the end of it. We got some sporadic bites today. It wasn't as consistent as it has been the past few times I've come out here. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check out the freaking merch in the description and we'll see you in the next video.